Hi everyone, I am your Punnam Venkat. Welcome again. So this is the second class of SD Enterprise Structure. Who are watching directly this class? My suggestion is please watch previous session Enterprise Structure 1 and this is the Enterprise Structure second class. If you watch, first you can watch previous class then if you watch this class then you will understand more effectively so in the last class we successfully uh, discussed like uh, company code sales organization distribution channel division sales office and sales group now we are going to discuss plant storage location and shipping point and enterprise structure assignment if you see the powerpoint presentation if you see the powerpoint presentation if you go up example yesterday we did for left side activities example company code sales organization sales office sales group distribution channel and division now we want to discuss plant shipping point and storage location after this now after this we can going to map like company code to sales organization and sales organization to other activities then how we will be going to integrate and mm and sd like blah 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 xyz we are going to discuss even the assignment everyone now today Let's discuss what is meant by plan. Why plan? What is the purpose of plant? What is the use of plant and all? So, how to create the plant? So, this is the I mean, uh, this is the path. Okay, SPRO, SAP reference, IMG, enterprise structure, definition, logistic general, and define plan. If you want to create the plant, you want to go this path. But before going to create the plant, just try to understand what is meant by plant. Let's go to the PowerPoint presentation PPT. Everyone, come down. So, this is the plant, everyone. So, basically, the plant is responsible by the MM consultant. In the MM module, Plant is the highest hierarchy. In the MM module, plant is the highest hierarchy. The plant is the physical location where we do the process of manufacturing the finished goods. Even within the company, we have n number of plants. Plant means it is the place where you manufacture the finished goods, where you manufacture the finished goods. So, you can contact your client, your client will be going to tell you under that your client company, how many plants is available, where it is available, exactly what process is going, which type of finished goods they are manufacturing into the specific plant. You want to collect the information, then you need to create the plant. Very simple everyone. Plant is the physical location where you manufacture the finished goods. Finished goods. Example, in my company, we have two plants, everyone. One is Tirupati Manufacturing Plant and Vizag Manufacturing Plant. Otherwise, Tirupati Plant and Vizag Plant. Two plants in under my company. So, how to create this plant in the SAP? How to create the plant in the SAP. Let it be everyone, concentrate here everyone. If you want to create, let's go to uh, this path everyone. SPRO, SAP reference IMG, enterprise structure, definition, logistic general, defined plan. Okay, let's go to this path and create the plan. Okay, and uh, Let's go to the path. This is the SAP Easy Access screen, everyone. Go to SPRO, enter, 
SAP reference IMG, select your uh, entry structure, then definition, then logistic general, and define, copy, delete plant. Everyone, I'm clearly telling you one point here the plant creation, plant maintenance will take care by the MM consultant. So, SD consultant is no way related in the real time. But <laughs> during the learning stage and here, you are everything. You want to take care of everything during the learning stage. Okay. Anyway, try to understand even how to create the plant, how to map the plant, how it can be integrate SD and the MM enterprise structures and all. Let's try to understand. In case everyone, if you want to understand more information, if you want to understand more information, what is mean by plant, why plant, what is the purpose of plant, just go through this document, everyone. So this is the document can be explained more information. What is the use of that and everything. Okay, just whenever you have the time, just go through this. And after understanding the plant, if you want to create the plant, then how? You just double click on this execute button, just create the plant. Example, I want to create two plants, everyone. Uh, Tirupati manufacturing plant and Vaisag manufacturing plant. Otherwise, uh, let's similar words, Tirupati plant and Vaisag plant. Okay, for simple manner. Okay. Anyway, plant nothing but it is a place where manufacturing the finished goods. Okay, let's create two plants, everyone. So, you just double click on this execute button. And click on here define plants and here click on here new entry and here you want to create the plant. I am repeating once again everyone, I am repeating once again, I am repeating once again everyone, concentrate here my dear students, concentrate here, concentrate here, come to this path, SPRO, SAP reference IMG, enterprise structure, definition, logistic general, Define, copy, delete, check, plan. You just double click on this execute button and click on your define plan and click on your new entry. Here you want to create the plan. So, everyone, so here you can set up here any four digit. It may be numerical or it may be alphabets. Why you want to set up here four digit? Up to four digit. Why means? That four digit is identification of your plan. For example, I am set up here uh, A1 TP. So A1 Tirupati plant. Tirupati plant. A1 Tirupati plant. Then here calendar. Calendar 01 is the standard calendar. 01 is the standard calendar. So press enter, everyone. Press enter. Then if you click on your save, one pop-up will come. There you want to maintain your plant address. Your plant address. Example, click on your save. One pop-up will come. So here you want to maintain your plant address. Okay, let's create this. Example, uh, uh, A1, Tirupati plant or manufacturing plant, whatever. Search term, A1TP, address, example, Balaji Nagar, house number 570 or 5300 and 25 and how, oh, this house number, everyone. House number 6767567 and 5300, pin code, then here Tirupati and here you can take uh, country India, region 01 and 25 and 25 here, post box number and postal code. Here you can maintain uh, plant telephonic number, mobile number, fax number, blah, 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 etc. Like so then click on your OK and save and save. See, all the address will pick automatically. Whatever you maintain, uh, that information will come. Then click on your save and back. 
I'm repeating once again, everyone. I can create one more plant for your understanding purpose. Everyone, I can create one more plant for Vizag plant. For Vizag plant, everyone. Let it be, everyone, come to this path, everyone. SPRO, SAP reference IMG, and enterprise structure, definition, logistic general, and define, copy, delete, check plan. You just double click on this execute button and click on your define plant and click on your new entry. Click on your new entry. Set up here any four digit and write the description. What is our four digit example? A1 uh, VVP. A1 VP. A1 VP means A1 Vijag plan. Vijag plant. And let it be A1 Vijag plant. So your factory calendar 01 is the standard. 01 is the standard. In the real time, your HR module, HR module people will suggest the calendar, which calendar they want to follow. In the real time, the uh, HR module people or HR module consultant can give the suggestions which calendar want to assign. But during the practice, you can assign 01 calendar. Okay, so press enter, press enter. So here, click on your save, one pop up will come. There you can maintain complete address. There you can maintain complete address. Example uh, A1, Vizag plant, and A1 Vizag plant. Search term A1 VP, then address, address uh, HT Street, house number 876. 897 and country India region 01 and here 53026 and here you can enter all the address telephonic number mobile number fax number for whom Vizag plant telephonic number, Vizag plant mobile number, Vizag plant email ID, all the communication details you want to maintain. After that, click on here, OK, and OK, then save and back. So everyone, here everyone, concentrate here. So this is the Tirupati plant and this is the Vizag plant. Click on here, save and back. Then you people want to ask one question, everyone. So after after creating the plant, in case in the future, if I want to change any field, example, I want to change the address, I want to change the mobile number, I want to change a telephonic number. In case if you want to change anything respect to plant details, how we can change? How we can change? Very simple, everyone. Come again, same path. Come again, same path. You just double click on this uh, execute button and click on your define plan. Again, you can go to same way. In case if you want to create new plan, in case if you want to create new plan, go to new entry. No, sir, I don't want to create new plan. I want to edit or I want to change existing plan. How we can change? That is also very simple, everyone. Click on your position. Then enter your plant up to four digit. What is that four digit? Example A1, TP, Tirupati plant. Press enter. So this is A1 Tirupati plant and A1 Vizag plant. A1 Vizag plant. So whatever you want to change, simply you just double click on that. And here you can change. And in case if you want to change the name, you can change it. You can change the calendar, you can change it. In case if you want to change the communication details, click on your address, this one, this one. Click on your this one. Here, you want, if you want to change anything, you can change. Okay. Except this four digit, everyone. Except this four up to four digit system can allow to change anything. Why? Because why we, we require to change means this year we can use some, some mobile number. Next year we can change the mobile number. 
maybe this year we can use some other email id next year we are going maybe maybe or may not maybe next year we are going to change the email id that time some changes is required okay click on your save and back click on your save and back the next one next one storage location very very important one storage location storage location everyone concentrate everyone what is meant by storage location why storage location let's go to ppt everyone let's go to ppt the next screen let's go to ppt uh, this is the storage location who is the responsible person or who is the responsible consultant to create the storage location to change the storage location everyone mm consultant mm consultant is responsible to create the storage location in the real time but now <laughs> during the practice you are mm you are sd you are everything you are everything in the during the learning stage we need to learn everything okay that is the reason try to understand what is meant by storage location very simple everyone within the plan within the plan storage location is the physical location storage location is an a physical location where you store the material example raw material finished goods semi finished goods where you are going to store the material within the plan within the plant for example everyone for example everyone in case uh, if you visit uh, amazon amazon plant flipkart plant you can visit any plant there is a couple of materials couple of materials okay they can store in different different uh, electronical goods plastic material different different type of material they will store okay so same way everyone same way example here also within the plant within the plant example what is meant by storage location within the plant storage location means it is a physical location where you can store example finished goods raw material and semi finished goods okay example everyone let it be i have two plants everyone I have two plants. What is that? One is A1 PP Tirupati plant. Try to understand here. Tirupati plant and A1 A1 VP Vijag plant. Vijag plant. And under this Tirupati plant, I will create some storage locations. Under this uh, this one. we will create some storage locations what is that example raw material storage location and finished goods storage location and blah 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 x y z blah 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 x y z i will create like this i will create like this okay example uh, a1 storage location finished goods storage location a finished good storage location f sl a uh, r ar s yes, sl and a yes sl semi finished goods location so this is my plan under the plan we are creating the storage location so here you can maintain up to four digit it may be numerical or it may be alpha it may be numerical and uh, it may be alphabets within the plan within the plan so we can purchase raw material we can make as a semi finished goods maybe we will purchase semi finished goods we will make it as a finished goods so different different type of material in the plant so all the materials different different material we can store in the different different area so it is a physical location where you can store the material where you will store the i mean where you will store the finished goods where you will store the raw material where you will store the semi finished goods like that and same way same activity same activity in this even vijog 
YZ plant also. Same activity who have YZ plant also. Okay, better you can note it down. You can note it like this. Okay. So how to create the storage location? How to create the storage location? Very simple, everyone. Very simple. This is the path, everyone. SPRO, SAP reference IMG, enterprise structure, definition, material uh, master or material management or maintain storage location. MM, material management, and maintain storage location. This is the path, everyone. Go to this path and maintain the storage location. Example, raw material storage location, finished goods storage location, semi-finished goods storage location, different, different type of storage locations we want to, I mean, create. In the real time, who is the responsible? Responsible is the MM consultant is the responsible. MM consultant is responsible. Okay. <coughs> Let it be. Everyone, consultate everyone. Let's go to SAP. Go back to SAP Easy Access screen or SAP Home screen. Everyone, consultate everyone. Go to SPRO, enter SAP Reference IMG and uh, select your uh, enterprise structure, definition, material management, and maintain storage location here, here everyone, here everyone and uh, enterprise structure, definition and material management and maintain storage location. Here you just double click on this execute button and create the storage location. So you just double click on this execute button and now here you want to give the plant means under the plant we need to create the storage locations example uh, here what is your plant everyone so here we maintain the plant right uh, a1 a1 pt a1 pt sorry tp a1 tp a1 tp in case if you are not remember this four digit sir i am unable to remember this a1 tp and all how I can remember. In case if you are not remember, click on your browse here. Click on this button and uh, press enter. So all the plants will come. All the plants will come. Now you can verify where it is. You can select your plant. A1 TP, right? A1. A, B, C, D alphabets. Here, A, B, C, D alphabets. A1 TP. Tirupati plant like that. Okay. Click on your A1 TP. So here you can maintain any four digit and click on your OK. Here. And click on your new entry. Here you want to maintain the storage location. So example in the Excel, AFSL, AM, I mean A1, finish the good storage location and write the description. Write the description. Here uh, you can maintain ARSL, I mean uh, raw material storage location and description and ASSL and uh, here semi finished good storage location. Guys, here I maintain something four digit everyone, up to four digit, it may be numerical or it may be alphabets. So this is not a standard, this is not a standard. Here you can maintain any four digit, up to four digit. It may be numerical or it may be alphabets for the identification of specific storage location. Press enter and save. So this storage location we are creating under the plan. Storage location we are creating under the plan. Okay, then click on your save and back. Click on here, save and black. back, save and back. Then one more, one more everyone, one more, one more everyone, one more. We have visual plant, A1 VP. So again, you just double click on this. Again, you just double click on this and give it your A1 VP, A1 VP. Then click on your OK. 
then click on your new entry set up here any four digit and write the description you can maintain same also no problem here this and this and this and description okay and next one and next one press enter and save press enter and save okay yeah the last step creation last step creation in the sap enterprise structure everyone we successfully completed this now shipping point what is meant by shipping point everyone you try to understand what is meant by ship ship the material from where shipping point means we need to ship the material from where to the customer location how to create the how to create the shipping point very simple everyone this is the shipping point how to create this is the path spro sap reference img enterprise structure definition logistic execution define copy delete check shipping point in case if you want to understand more information in case if you want to understand more information what is mean by shipping point why shipping point let's go to the powerpoint ppt last screen everyone everyone concentrate here, everyone shipping point is responsible by the sd consultant shipping point is responsible by the sd consultant shipping point is a physical location everyone concentrate here everyone. a shipping point is the physical location is responsible for pick the material or load the material customer location we need to pick the material everyone it is the place where customer receive the finished goods it is in a place where customer is received the finished goods i mean cust all the customers will come otherwise we can send to the customer location from one location so shipping point is one location where ship the material to customer example in my company we have two shipping point tirupati shipping point and vijog shipping point tirupati shipping point and the vijog shipping point two types of uh, shipping points so how to create this shipping point example this is the responsible by the sd consultant sd consultant is responsible okay <clears throat> so everyone and in case if you want to create the shipping point and uh, like uh, go to this path spro sap reference img enterprise structure definition and logistic execution define shipping point so this is a path everyone this is an a path let's go to this path everyone go to spro enter sap reference img select your uh, enterprise structure and here definition and uh, logistic execution here everyone here this one define copy delete check shipping point so you just double click on this execute button and here double click on define shipping point and here you want to create the shipping point very simple everyone shipping point is the physical location where you can ship the finished goods to the customer it is a physical location so what we will do on that physical location we can ship and load the material to customer okay so come to this path and in case if you want to understand more information what is meant by shipping point why shipping point just go through this document everyone so this document can give more information okay and uh, you just double click on this execute button in case if you want to create and define shipping point and click on your new entry 
and double click on up to four digit and write the description example up to four digit means example a one i have two shipping points everyone i have two shipping points tirupati shipping point and vijag shipping point a one uh, example uh, a1 t s a1 tirupati shipping point so here a1 ts is a not a standard everyone here you can set up up to four digit it may be numerical or it may be alphabets any any four digit and here you can try assign the calendar calendar 01 is the standard then press enter enter then if you click on your save first one pop up will come there you want to maintain your shipping point address your shipping point address okay you can maintain any address everyone you can maintain any address click on your save example here i am maintaining here everyone uh, a1 let us assume a1 tirupati shipping point and a1 tirupati shipping point and search term a1 ts a1 ts and here street let it be balaji nagar house number 8971233321 and 5025025 tirupati country india region 01 and 25 and 25 and here click on your ok click on your ok then save ok see here like this you want to maintain the shipping point if you click on this all the address will come all the address will come this is the shipping point everyone i can maintain one more one more everyone i am repeating once again i want to create one more Vijag shipping point. Vijag shipping point. So you just to come to this path, everyone. Come to this path and double click on this execute button and uh, click on your define shipping point and click on your new entry. Set up here any four digit and write the description. Example A1, uh, A1, example YVS, A1. Vijag shipping point and here factory calendar 01 press enter then uh, click on your save and back click on your save here one pop up will come there you can maintain the complete address example a1 Vijag shipping point point such term example a1 vs a1 vs and address example uh, a1 street house number uh, 54534213 five, 5000 26 vijag country india region 01 and 26 and 26 and here you can enter telephonic number mobile number fax number blah 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 so and click on your ok and ok save and back here everyone you can note it down this a1 ts a1 vs a1 Tirupati shipping point, A1 Vijag shipping point. This is a two shipping points. Agreement. This is a uh, two shipping points. Click on your yes, save and back. So, like this, everyone, like this, you want to create complete enterprise structure. We successfully created enterprise structure. So, all the creation we did, what we did, everyone. We successfully created enterprise structure. Now we want to map. We want to map the enterprise structure or assign assign the enterprise structure. 
we want to assign our company code to shipping point shipping point i mean our company i mean our company code to sales organization sales organization to sales office sales office sales group how you can map this mapping nothing but assignment everyone i am sincerely requesting one thing everyone before going to uh, i mean assignment before going to assignment i am sincerely requesting everyone if you really like this video please don't forget to subscribe the channel so your subscription is our encouragement everyone if you want to encourage our punna mighty channel kindly subscribe our channel everyone if you are not like our video not required to subscribe <laughs> very simple everyone if you like our videos and if you can subscribe you are not like our videos then don't subscribe okay let it be let's go to assign enterprise structure assignment nothing but mapping to map the enterprise structure example first step assign sales organization to company code who is the responsible for this to assignment sd consultant so this assign sales organization to company code who is the responsible responsible is sd consultant example let's observe this diagram everyone we successfully created our company code we successfully created our sales organization now we want to assign or we want to map our company code to sales organization sir why why we want to map or why we want to assign why because system understanding purpose system want to understand the sales organization belongs to which company in the system there have lot of companies and lot of sales organizations so this sales organization belongs to which company or which company code system want to understand based on your mapping then only system will understand okay this sales organization is belongs to this company code so now my target is i want to assign our sales organization to company code so how to assign very simple everyone so now our target is to assign so who is the responsible sd consultant so how to assign this is the path everyone how to assign this is the path like uh, spro sap reference img enterprise structure assignment sales and distribution and assign sales organization to company code everyone concentrate everyone i'm i'm go back go back to sap easy access screen sap easy access screen nothing but sap home screen so go to spro enter sap reference img and uh, select here enterprise structure and definition and sorry everyone here everyone here you can catch one point everyone here you can patch catch one point if you want to create the enterprise structure everyone here you can catch one point everyone if you want to create the enterprise structure you want to go definition if you want to assign or map the enterprise structure you want to go assignment creation go to definition assignment or mapping go to assignment and uh, go to assignment and that to sales and distribution first one everyone assign sales organization to company code then who is the responsible responsible is sd consultant and you just double click on this execute button and uh, click on your position what is your sales organization example my sales organization is a1 yes wo here everyone a1 domestic sales organization a1 foreign sales organization two types of sales organizations we created for this 
विच अंडर विच कंपनी ए वन वन जीरो वन वन जीरो ए वन स्टील प्राइवेट लिमिटेड प्रेस एंटर एंड दिस इज ऑल्सो ए वन वन जीरो प्रेस एंटर एंड हियर यू कैन गो बैक अगेन दिस इज अवर एवरी ए वन डोमेस्टिक सेल्स ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ए वन फॉरन सेल्स ऑर्गेनाइजेशन this under this company this is the sales organizations click on your save and back click on your save and back the next one next one is assign distribution channel to sales organization assign distribution channel to sales organization who is the responsible responsible is the sd consultant responsible is sd consultant let's go to our map everyone assign distribution channel this is the distribution channel like we created wholesaler distributor like that this is the distribution channel and this is the sales organization so we want to assign our sales organization to distribution channel assignment nothing but mapping assignment nothing but mapping okay let's assign that same path everyone same path same to same path enterprise structure assignment sales and distribution next one assign distribution channel to sales organization you just double click on this execute button and click on your new entry what is your sales organization everyone a1 ds domestic here uh, a distributor and a1 ds and here a wholesaler press enter then again a1 ds here a1 ef everyone foreign A one FS, A one FS, AD, and A one FS, and AW. Enter. Better note it down, everyone. Note it down. You can pause the video and note it down. Domestic sales organization assigned to distributor. Domestic sales organization assigned to wholesaler. foreign sales organization assigned to distributor foreign sales organization assigned to wholesaler better note it down and click on your save and back the next one next one assign division to sales organization assign division to sales organization who is the responsible responsible is sd consultant assign division to sales organization third one assign division to sales organization same path everyone same path what is the path same path next one assign division to sales organization so let's go to our diagram assign division to this is the division division to our sales organization division to sales organization like this example like this okay assign division to sales organization next point everyone you just uh, double click on this assign sorry distribution channel to sales organization done assign division to sales organization double click on this and click on your new entry what is your sales organization a1 ds year a opp division a1 ds a ppp division again a1 f foreign and opp and a fs and a ppp 
note it down everyone note it down this domestic sales organization to opp division and ppp division foreign sales organization to opp division and ppp division you can pause the video and note it down okay then click on your save and back click on your save and back the next one next one is set up sales area set up sales area is very important everyone set up sales area okay what is meant by sales area let's see everyone same path same path everyone you just double click on this execute button so what is meant by sales area sales area is combination of sales organization distribution channel and division interview question everyone what is meant by sales area sales area is combination of sales organization distribution channel and division distribution channel and the division let's do that one by one so here our target is let's go to our map sales organization means i mean sales area means we need to assign uh, sales organization distribution channel and division these three things everyone let it be what what we need to do these three things sales organization distribution channel and division these three activities these three things we are called as a sales area sales area nothing but sales organization distribution channel and division so let's assign that let's assign come to this path everyone same path everyone same path double click on this execute button example who is the responsible for this who is the responsible sd consultant only responsible sd consultant only responsible and uh, yeah so double click on this execute same path everyone same path double click on this execute button and click on your new entry so what is mean by sales organization sales organization is a1 domestic sales distribution channel uh, distributor here k o enter k o everyone k o enter again OPP division again A1 DS AD and here A P PPP division again A1 DS uh, A W wholesaler and A O and A1 ds aw and ap enter note it down everyone clearly and use uh, control y select all control c and paste it here you can change the sales organization fs enter better you can note it down everyone this is the foreign sales organization foreign sales organization distribution channel and division domestic sales organization distribution channel and division press enter and save press enter and save better you can note it down for more clarity so yesterday we successfully created this everyone example sales organization distribution channel division we created this okay we created this and click on your save and back the next one next one assign sales office to sales organization assign sales office to sales organization so what is this just go to diagram assign sales office to sales organization this is the one everyone assign sales of organization to sales office these two things we want to assign 
mapping yesterday we created today we are going to map why i want to map system want to understand the sales office belongs to which sales organization the sales organization to belongs to which company system want to understand that is the reason we are going to map so now we want to assign these two things how to assign same path everyone same same path sd consultant only responsible let it be you can add here in the excel who is responsible sd consultant only responsible here we want to add okay and you just double click on this sign sales office to sales area and click on your new entry example everyone control v we we copied we created na sales area example our sales area let it be a1 domestic sales area example a distributor and here a wo sales office a a1 so okay here a1 ds ad and here a p a1 so here a1 ds a w a o a1 so and again a1 ds a w a p a1 so and press enter everyone concentrate here everyone this is my sales organization this is my distributors and this is my divisions this is this is an a my sales office we are going to link or we are going to map or we are going to assign okay and again you can use control y select all control c and paste it here you can change the sales organization example foreign press enter so this is the foreign everyone this is on a foreign foreign sales organization distribution channel division and sales office <laughs> better note it down everyone note it down clearly okay you can pause the video and note it down clearly otherwise you people will going to confuse okay and click on your save sir when you created this yesterday i mean last class we created last class we created this okay then click on your save and back the next one next one create sales group to sales office who is the responsible sd consultant only responsible create sales group to sales office and what is that here here everyone i mean not create assign assign sales group to sales office sorry everyone assign sales group to sales office here this is my sales office this is my sales group so we want to assign these two things everyone we want to assign these two things okay so same path everyone same path is next one assign sales office to sale assign sales of group to sales office click on your new entry what is your sales office a 1 so and a opp sales group and a1 so a ppp sales group press enter and save note it down and click on your save and back the next one assign plant to company code 
assign plant to company code who is the responsible assign plant to company code mm consultant is responsible mm consultant is responsible by assign plant to company code so let's go to our map everyone this is my company code and this is my plant so we want to assign these two things everyone we want to assign these two things okay let's assign this so what is the path this is the path everyone spro sap reference img enterprise structure assignment and logistic general assign plan to company code assign plan to company code and uh, let's go back go back <coughs> go to spro enter sap reference img select your uh, enterprise structure definition logistic general so not not definition sorry everyone assignment logistic general here assign plant to company code assign plant to company code you just double click on this execute button click on your new entry so what is your company code a110 what is your plant a1 tirupati plant and a1 10 and a1 vijag plant vijag plant two plants so this plant created today only in this class only enter so this is my company code and this is my plan click on your save and back better note it down you can pause the video and note it down so in the next one assign sales organization distribution channel and plan assign sales organization distribution channel and plan so what is that assign this is my company code assign sales organization distribution channel and plan so how we can do that assign sales organization everyone assign sales organization distribution channel and plant here here everyone plant distribution channel and sales organization these three things how we mapped same thing you can assign you can observe my screen everyone these three things we want to map okay so how we can map how we can map this is the path everyone spro sap reference img the enterprise structure assignment sales and distribution and sales organization and uh, i mean sales organization distribution channel and plant so you want to assign this one it's a it's a lengthy class actually but you can focus focus and listen careful and you can create the objectives you can map the objectives you can take sap server access and do the uh, practice in case if you want uh, sap server access for the practice please contact me i can provide you vendor details who will provide the server access okay and uh, everyone this is the path everyone and uh, let's go this example uh, go to sap easy access screen spro enter sap reference img example enterprise structure definite sorry assignment sales and distribution here everyone here this one assign sales organization distribution channel and division just double click on this click on your new entry sales organization a1 domestic distribution channel ad and plant a tirupati plant a1 tp a1 bs a ad and a1 vp again a1 ds a w 
and a1 v i mean pp pp and a1 ds a w a1 vp enter note it down everyone and this is for domestic then let's assign for foreign and copy this control c and paste it here you can assign the foreign a1 foreign enter so this is the one so this is the foreign sales organization distribution channel and plant domestic sales organization distribution channel and plant better note it down everyone note it down clearly and after note it down please take sap server access for the practice let's do the practice everyone in case if you want to server access for the practice please contact me i can give you vendor details who can provide the sap server then click on your save and back the last assignment in the enterprise structure assign shipping point to plant assign shipping point to plant everyone who is the responsible this one is done and uh, now last one assign shipping point to plant sd consultant is responsible everyone sd consultant is responsible assign shipping point to plant so this is a shipping point and this is the plant we want to assign these two things shipping point to plant okay and uh, last one what is the path let's see the path everyone spro sap reference img enterprise structure assignment logistic execution and assign shipping point to plant here logistic execution assign shipping point to plant this one everyone this is the path everyone enterprise structure assignment logistic execution assign shipping point to plant spro sap reference img like that okay and you just double click on this execute button and here something is difficult everyone so please concentrate here so there is a lot of plant is there if you go down there is a lot of plants and assignment everyone here you can do everyone concentrate here, everyone concentrate here first you have to take the plant and later you have to take the shipping point okay first click on your find here here click on your find what is your plant my plant is example uh, um a1 a1 pp enter and double click on this this is my plant tirupati plant for this we have example everyone let it be shipping point we have uh, i mean uh, one shipping point for that and select this click on your assignment assign and again control again control f control f find and what is that a1 sp shipping point then click on your ok a1 sp is not there a1 i mean a TSP, I believe, Tirupati shipping point. So, which shipping point you created? A1, A, something A, TP. Go down, go down, you can verify manually. We forgot what is the four digit for that. Go down, verify manually what we created. See here A1 TS Tirupati shipping point, A1 VS Vijog shipping point. Example select here Tirupati shipping point, then click on here. Okay, 
Let's see everyone. Now this one. A1 Tirupati and Tirupati shipping. Everyone. Concentrate here. Concentrate here, everyone. Concentrate here. Now this is Vijak shipping point. Select here Vijak shipping point. Click on your assign. Now control F. Uh, yeah, like A V S P. A V S P. Click on your OK. A V S P not there. Maybe A one S P. A one V P or V S. A one V S I believe. A one V S. This one. This one everyone. A one V S. A one Vijak shipping point. Okay. This one everyone. A one Tirupati plant and A one Tirupati shipping point. A one Vijak plant and A one Vijak shipping point. Click on your save and back. Everyone, now I can I can see one uh, magic everyone in the SAP. What magic everyone? Example, let's see my diagram everyone. Let's see my diagram. So this is the company code. Under this we created sales organization and distribution channel. Under this, this is the objectives. Under this, this is the objectives. Whatever you created and whatever you map, I may want to view same diagram in the SAP. I mean, not same, look like, look like same type of diagram in SAP. Yes, you can view the enterprise structure like diagram. What is your company? What is your sales organization? What is your uh, plant? And what is your distribution channel? What is your division? Each and every point you can view what you are created, what you are mapped, you can observe. For that purpose, which T code I want to go? Everyone, this is the T code, everyone. EC01. EC01. Go to EC01. EC01. Enter. And click on your organization or so organization structure or whatever. Click on your navigation and click on your OK. And here all the company codes will come. So go to your company code. Example, use control F, enter here your company code. My company code is called A110. Otherwise, you can verify manually also. Let's go down and uh, you can go to your company code. But I'm using Control F. I'm entering my company code A110. Then click on your OK. Double click on this. This is my company code, everyone. You just double click on your company code. See, let's see, everyone. This is my company code A110, A1 Steels Private Limited. For this, we created one plant and one sales organization. Same look like, label, same look like. Company code, sales organization and plant. And if you elaborate this plant, we have Tirupati plant and Vaisak plant. Two plants you created. Elaborated Tirupati plant. And under the Tirupati plant, we have plant store, I mean, storage area, storage location or whatever. Storage location. Finished good storage location, raw material storage location, and semi finished good storage location, and distribution channel and shipping point. See under Tirupati, and even Vijag also. If you click on your elaborated Vijag, see this one how this Vijag. Same way, if you come down, if you come down, if you elaborate it, uh, you can elaborate sales organization. Under the sales organization, we have domestic sales organization and foreign sales organization. You can elaborate it domestic. Elaborate it here, everyone. This is my this is my divisions, sales organization to divisions. Okay, come down, come down. You can elaborate it. This one. 
company code and division so you can absorb this one everyone you can absorb this what we created what we assign how you assign everything will come here okay click on here so this is the enterprise structure everyone this is enterprise structure for the new video the next topic when the new video will we are going to make everyone i am sincere requesting to everyone i am my sincere request is if you like this video don't forget to subscribe this channel okay kindly subscribe our channel and support thank you everyone support means how you can support only subscribe okay not donate any amount no, no not required any amount everyone just your subscribe is our encouragement everyone encouragement us okay and uh, not required any <laughs> donation and all just subscribe that's it thank you everyone bye everyone if you like this video don't forget to subscribe